बसमीम आज हम डिस्कस करने जा रहे हैं एफ का पेपर है असिस्टेंट डायरेक्टर नैब के लिए जो 2009 में हेल्ड हुआ था और इसका पार्ट फर्स्ट है क्वेश्चन नंबर वन द प्रेजिडेंट ऑफ पाकिस्तान इन कंसल्टेशन विद दी is competent to make any order for the purpose of removing any difficulty in respect of neb ordinance option a chief justice of pakistan chief justice of high court chief minister of pakistan prime minister of pakistan option a is correct question number 2 neb ordinance shall come into force at once and shall be deemed to have come into force from the first day of january 1985 first day of january 1989 first day of january 2000 first day of january 1999 nine, 1999 option a is correct question number 3 NAB ordinance was passed by president on November 16, 1999, November 17, 1999, November 18, 1999, November 19, 1999. Option A is correct. Question number four. National Accounting Ministry Bureau ordinance. 1999 was promulgated by President Farooq Ahmed Lagari, President Rafiq Tara, Pervez Musharraf, and of option C is correct. Question number five: The Chairman Nab may resign his office by writing under his hand address to Chief Justice of Pakistan, President of Pakistan. Prime Minister of Pakistan, Chairman of Senate. Option B is correct. Question number six. As and when the Chairman Nab is absent or unable to perform the function of his office due to any reason whatsoever, will act as the Chairman Nab, Chief Justice of Pakistan, President of Pakistan, Prime Minister of Pakistan, Deputy Chairman Nab. Option D is correct. Question number seven: Who appoints Prosecutor General Accountability? Chief Justice of Pakistan, President of Pakistan, Prime Minister of Pakistan, Chairman Nab. Option D is correct. Question number eight: Who gave advice to Chairman Nab about such legal matter and performed such other duties of a legal character as may be? Referred or assigned to him by the chairman, and and in the present and in the performance of his duties, he shall have the right of audience in all courts established under his under this ordinance, and shall other courts and tribunal in Pakistan. The Chief Justice of Pakistan, President of Pakistan, Prime Minister of Pakistan, prosecute. General Accountability Bureau. Option D is correct. Question number nine. In consultation with in consultation with the Attorney General of Pakistan, may with prior approval of Chairman Nab appoint special prosecutor to conduct prosecution of specific cases. Chief Justice of Pakistan, President of Pakistan, Prime Minister of Pakistan, Prosecutor General, Accountability Bureau. Option D is correct. Question number ten. Headquarters National Accountability Bureau, NAB, is at Islamabad, Pakistan, Quetta, Pakistan, Lahore, Punjab, Nanafdeez. Option A is correct. Question number eleven. The National Accountability Bureau was established on November sixteen, two 
1999 नवंबर 17 1999 नवंबर 18 1999 नवंबर 19 1999 ऑप्शन इज करेक्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर 12 द चेयरमैन नेव इज द हेड ऑफ इन्स इन्वेस्टिगेशन एंड सर्व फॉर द टर्म ऑफ 4 ईयर 3 ईयर 5 ईयर नन ऑफ देम ऑप्शन इज करेक्ट क्वेश्चन नंबर 13 The prosecutor general is the head of prosecution and serves from term of four year, three year, five year, none of them. Option B is correct. Question number fourteen. Who may impose other condition for for release from custody or detention? Chief Justice of Pakistan, President of Pakistan, Prime Minister, Chairman Nair. Option D is correct. Question number fifteen: The amount deposited by with the NAB shall be transferred to the federal government, or as the case may be, a provincial government or the concerned bank or financial institution, etc. Within. Of the date of such deposit, one month, two month, three month, six month. Option A is correct. Question number sixteen: A person who commits the offence of corruption and corrupt practices shall be punishable with imprisonment for a term which may extend to fourteen year or with fine or with both. Fifteen year or with fine or both. Sixteen year or with fine or with both. Seventeen year or with fine or both. Option A is correct. Question number seventeen. Any person giving illegal gratification or abetting, assisting or aiding a holder of public office. or receiving or holding any property obtained or acquired by a holder of public office through corruption or corrupt practices or being a beneficiary for of any asset property or gain obtained through corruption or corrupt practices shall fall within the scope of this section and shall be liable to the same or a lesser punishment that may be awarded to a holder of public office as may be deemed fit by the court nab chairman nab appropriate property none of these option a is correct question number 18 where a person found guilty of an offence is sentenced to pay a fine irrespective of whether or not a sentence of imprisonment is imposed the amount of the fine shall in no case be less than the gain drawn by the accused or any relative or associate which may be set off against the forfeited or frozen asset and property forfeited or frozen property forfeited or frozen assets none of these option a is correct Question number nineteen: Trying a person for any offence as specified under this ordinance may, at any time, if there appear reasonable ground for believing that the accused has committed such an offence, order the freezing of his property, movable or immovable, or part thereof. Whether in his possession or in the possession of any relative, associate, or person on his behalf, court nab, chairman nab, appropriate property, both A and B. Option D is correct. Question number twenty: If the property ordered to be frozen under subsection A is a debt or any other movable property, the freezing may be made. Be seized by uh, sorry by seizure by appointment of receiver by prohibiting the delivery of such property to the accused or to anyone on his behalf. All of these. Option D is correct. Question number twenty one. 
if the property order to be frozen is removable the freezing shell in the case of land bank revenue be made through the collector of the district in which the land is situated and in all other cases by taking possession by appointment of receiver by pro prohibiting the payment of rent or delivery of property to the accused or to any other person on his behalf all of these option d is correct question number 22 if the property order to be frozen consists of livestock or is of a perishable nature may if it deem proper and expedient order the immediate sale thereof and the proceeds of sale may be deposited with the German lab or the court or as either may direct as appropriate court lab, German lab, appropriate property both there and be option D is correct question number 23 what is the punishment of refusal to answer question or to provide information to the national accountability bureau or any other agency when required to do so two year or less three year or less four year or less five year or less option d is correct question number 24 what is the punishment for giving or Fabricating false evidence during inquiry investigation of offense by National Accountability Bureau or any agency. Three year or less, five year or less, seven year or less, eight year or less. Option B is correct. Question number 25. What is the punishment for fraud? 14 year or less, 13 year or less, 12 year or less, 11 year or less. Option A is correct. Question number 26. Who was the first Prime Minister of Pakistan? Raja Nazmuddin, Liaqat Ali Khan, Abdurrahman Nishtar, I.I. Chundrigar. Option B is correct. Question number 27. You know oil for food program is associated with which country? Sudan, North Korea, Iran, Iraq. Option D is correct. Question number 28. Who was the first Asian to have received the Nobel Prize? C.V. Raman, R. N. Tagore, Mother Teresa, I. Abonin. Option B is correct. Question number 29. Masjid Wazir Khan is located in Multan, Chatta, Karachi, Lahore. Option D is correct. Question number 30. When Pakistan won the Cricket World Cup 1922, 1926, 1999, 2003. Option A is correct. Question number 31. Name the king who fell from the horse while playing polo and died. Akbar Muhammad Ghori, Zairuddin Babar, Kutputin Abak. Option D is correct. Question number 32. Peer Poor Report was published in 1938, 1939, 1940, 1941. Option A is correct. Question number 1. The President of Pakistan, in consultation with the is competent to make any order for the purpose of removing any difficulties in respect of NAB ordinance. Option A Chief Justice of Pakistan, Chief Justice of High Court, Chief Minister of Pakistan, Prime Minister of Pakistan. Option A is correct. Question number 2. NAB ordinance shall come into force at once and shall be deemed to have come into force from the first day of January 1985, first day of January 1989, first day of January 2000, first day of January 1999. 
option is correct. Question number three. Lab ordinance was passed by President on November 16, 1990. Question number 38. The Eiffel Tower is located in Germany, France, Italy, Australia. Option B is correct. Question number 39. Napoleon Bonaparte was the king of France, Italy, England, none of them. Option A is correct. Question number 40. In which year this is battle be battle between Muhammad bin Qasim and Raja Tahir was for 712, 711, 715, 718. Option A is correct. Question number 41. The deepest point in the ocean is Mariana Trench, Galati Deep, Bartholon Deep, Mindanao Deep. Option A is correct. Question number 42. Fear of height is called Autophobia, Agoraphobia, Acrophobia, both here and C. Option D is correct. Question number 43. Pakistan National Movement was established by Chaudhary Rahmatli in 1935, 1937, 1938, 1933. Option D is correct. Question number 44. Who was the first president of Constitution? Assembly Constituent Assembly Pajan Azmuddin, Lakhatli Khan, Kaidi Azam, Abdurab Nishta. Option C is correct. Question number 45. Name the first woman speaker of US Congress is Nancy Palote, Condoleezza Rice, Nancy Powell, Hillary Clinton. Option A is correct. Question number 46. Which is the largest state of USA? New York, California, Texas, Alaska. Option D is correct. Question number 47. Who is the first woman speaker of National Assembly of Pakistan? Sobhya Ramzan, Fahmida Birza, Shir Rahman, Ifat Option B is correct. Question number 48. Name the first man to reach the South Pole on December 14, 1911 was Sir Francis Drake, Donald Munson, the navigator, Ferdinand Magellan, none of the above. Option B is correct. Question number 49. Donald Munson belonged to England, Norway, England, USA. Option B is correct. Question number 50. Which one of the following gas was used as a chemical weapon in the First World War? Carbon monoxide, hydrogen cyanide, mustard gas, none of these. Option C is correct. If you like this video, please like this video.